Hey guys, welcome to the channel. In today's video, we'll take a look at Zoho CRM pricing plans. We'll compare them according to their features. What do they provide? Is it suitable as for you? So to not make any mistakes, just simply watch this video till the very end. And the first thing you need to know is that you can easily uh, use a free trial to like try every single plan you want to buy. Standard, professional, enterprise or ultimate they provide us the opportunity to buy four different plans. And let's take a look at what do they provide. As you can see, prices are different, like 14 euros, 23, 40, 52, and so on. If we're going to pay monthly, we'll have to pay a little bit more, like up to 34%. So if you are going to use Zoho CRM for a long time, more than a year, I definitely recommend you to use this discount to save 34% and to pay like only 14, 23 and 40 euros per month. And basically, um, yeah, that's that's really good. So let's scroll down for a little and see all the features, what is available for standard plan, professional, enterprise and ultimate. I don't really think that it's important to speak about ultimate because it's only suitable for huge teams, for huge companies. So let's compare standard, professional and enterprise. And as you can see, uh, both of all, all the plans, they have the option for like basic models, tasks, calls, events, advanced uh, filters, multiple pipelines, scrolling rules, sales, forecasting, email insights and multiple currencies option. But uh, if we want to use macroses, sales signals, assignment rules, it will be better to use a professional and the other features such as multiple scrolling rules, custom sales signals, uh, email parsers, data entry wizards and portals is available only for enterprise. And in my case, uh, the most suitable plan as for me is a standard because I don't want to use, for example, macroses, sales signals and so on. Let's see what's about like automation and process management, uh, workflow rules and email notifications that are available for all the plans but blueprint, webhooks only for professional and uh, higher and record approval process, data review process, custom functions, common center, enterprise and higher. Product customization, we have like homepage customization uh, enabled for all plans, rename tabs, custom list use, custom fields, canvas and tab groups. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Report and analysis. Predefined report, predefined dashboards, dashboard components, analytics, mobile app, and so on. Artificial intelligence, which is like pretty cool, but it's available for only enterprise and ultimate. So if you want to get this feature by Zoho CRM, so you can only buy enterprise and higher. Marketing automation, we have like email templates, email notification, mass email, and social profile integrations for every single plan and email replies, CRM for Google Ads for professional and some other features for higher plans. Developer hub here and security. And as you can see, standard uh, is like quite good, but professional contains more features. And basically, if you like interested in buying plan, I recommend you to use a professional. But of course, you can start from standard and after that, just simply upgrade plan to the higher one. So just simply click on try it for free, try your plan, and then you'll be able to basically upgrade it if you need. Hope this video helped you out. Leave a like, subscribe, and goodbye, guys.